So I previously reported on this whole situation with Rissa and Quan. Now Quan went on to Instagram and announced that he was single, as well as Rissa and Quan unfollowed each other on Instagram, and Quan removed all of Rissa's photos from his profile. Now Rissa left all of Quan's photos up, but then Quan also went onto threads and started saying things like he doesn't trust anyone. So then shortly after, Rissa went on to post pictures of them from the family vacation. Now he also posted up photos, but he didn't include Rissa or the kids. So this confused a lot of people and Quan got really upset after Rissa decided to post him on her Instagram after he just stated that he was single. So he went on to post then quickly delete. I'm not playing no social media games or trying to confuse y'all. But since she wants to post me like ish is a game, I have no choice but to let it be known that it's over and I'm dead serious. The only reason I ain't air everything out is out of respect for my kids and to spare her. Then he also says, been praying on my downfall for the longest. Thank you to everyone who genuinely care about me and support me. I hope y'all know that I stayed solid. Everything on my end was real and regardless, I'm gonna remain a good person that I am. I'm gonna give social media a rest for some time. I hope y'all understand love. So then Rissa goes on to Twitter and releases a statement. She says, y'all, we never ever do anything like this on social media. You guys know us better than that. Things are a little out of hand right now and emotions are coming into play, which is why any of this is happening right now. Everyone just needs to get a clear mind and give it some time. So it seems like Rissa isn't trying to expose the issues in their relationship, but someone saw them at the airport and stated, I just saw Rissa in the Bahamas, her whole family in the airport going back home. Quan wasn't present and we was on the same flight. And someone else stated, my sister told me the same thing. She was at the airport also. So it appears that something happened on that family vacation and Quan didn't go back home with Rissa and the kids. Now it appears that he is actually at his mother's home. He posted a photo and he didn't look too happy and he stated, Mama's food always gives me an appetite. So it appears that Quan is back home with his parents while Rissa is with the kids. Now you guys leave your opinions on this down in the comment section below. Do you guys think that this is the end of Rissa and Quan? So now Sierra joined Funny Mike's live to call Runic out for not taking care of his kids. Sierra say take care of your kids, Runic. Aisha recently gave birth to her baby girl and people were actually questioning was she going to be hiding the baby's face like DDG? This was Daisha's response. So I'm not being like anybody, but I feel like it's very necessary to protect your baby's image in the very first, in those very first few days. She's not gonna look how she look right now in the next couple of weeks. She's gonna change, even dream like, dream changed so many times so it's just like y'all don't need to see all that y'all don't need to see all that when i'm ready to show her face i'll show her face i didn't show dreams face until like three months after i want to say two to three months after she was born to, you know they go through create a cap they go through so much so many changes and so many things you know i don't want her criticized right now for nothing for no changes that she's about to go through she she is beautiful but either way y'all just want to take some shit and go try to sit the shade room they can wait y'all can wait she'll be seen when she's supposed to be seen that's just they don't need it
But I'm not, I'm not like trying to be like nobody. I had dream face and I had a kid before him. So he trying to be like me, if that's the case. Her weight was. So now there were recent rumors that Neek and Dwayne broke up after they unfollowed each other on Instagram. But now Neek is actually getting her teeth done in Colombia and Dwayne was on Instagram live and people kept asking where Neek was. All right, you guys, so I'm here with Oral Harmony, Dr. Sebastian. Say hi. Hi. Look how cute his teeth is, y'all. Today we're about to do a whole veneer reveal for myself and y'all. So you ready? I am nervous, but I am. <laughs> Three, okay, bet. Okay, two, you gonna count down? Yeah. Three, two, one. Ah! They are so cute. I, oh my gosh, I love them. I, I was so nervous. You was nervous? Yeah. Y'all ain't gonna be able to tell me I nothing. Love them. They look so nice, so beautiful. I kept telling him I wasn't no nervous. I, ah, no horse teeth, period. Yes. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Neat minding her damn business. No, no. Oh, my bad. Dude, <laughs> niggas was in that scent playing pool. Yeah, y'all asked too many questions, but nigga don't deal with all that. My bad, though. I ain't even, you feel me? Knock down. Mm, 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 mm. Go out, go out. 